guys, Sheep here with more Hive Swap. Algae's kicking your butts. You're kicking mine. Yeah, let's not delete that. Let's load it. Oh, jeez. What was I actively doing? I had a burb. So you go this way. Will there be a monster? Nope. Um. Carefully remove the marble pouch from his neck, and believe it or not, shove the marbles in the empty eye sockets. You discard the pouch. What an evening it's been. Uh, look at it. Your pa loves glow. Er, your pa's love of. There's my sentences for the day. Your pa's love of globes knows no bounds. But you don't recognize any of the continents on this one. You'd have a better idea of what you were looking at if you could read the scribbly labels. All you can make sense of is the X mark could indicate treasure. Uh, spin it? Oh! That's mine now. That would you soon to be the attic key. She even locked. Why is it even locked? Got the key, heading back to the attic now. Careful, may not be that simple. Over. What do you mean? None of this has been simple. <laughs> it's been downright convoluted. Noticing hostile elements, grouping serpents. Wait. Noticing hostile elements, grouping serpents, massing over. Oh, jeez. Try to back you up if possible. Main alert says over. I was Ambro, over and out. We're gonna have like a whole building full of snakes. All right. Let's do this. It's okay, we got two pairs of shoes and a flashlight. Uh oh. Oh jeez. Okay, so you got a lot of arms. You also have a lot of arms. You have no arms. I, uh, what? Uh, I hope this guy isn't hungry. What are you saying he's like 90% mouth? <laughs> oh no! Oh, what, what's he gonna do? Uh, flares. Flare gun. Even loading the flare gun is extremely unsafe. You don't even like to single load it. Sometimes, sometimes the general will mislead from the front. That would you mean fire a single flare from the safety of his treehouse. He's prepared. Uh, anything you toss in there, you're never getting back. The bird. <laughs> Let's ballet around this. Uh, all right. There's no getting past this. A this behemoth right now. Focus on the relatively smaller ones. What do I have that could possibly... Flashlight? Ah! No excuses. Why... Why are the arrows up? Alright. Oh, it's already loaded. Alright, Jude, let's do this. Don't shoot with your eyes closed! Well, actually, it's a flare gun. Maybe that's a good idea. Let's analyze the situation. Old razzle dazzle, huh? Let's do it. 
putting on the Brits. Oh, so you're gonna smack the little one? Well, fine! Alright, two down. Till I had to see it. Uh. Left dude, what are you waiting for? Okay. You look so concerned. Oh, snap. Dude, no! Dude, you're the most fired human being. Actually, a giant fire outside might help. Ten out of ten, Jude. Ow! Yeah, let's let's do this. Signature style and flare. Yeah, let's let's just run for it. What are you doing? Hurry! I'll use that key. Oh, jeez. Two and lost. Now what in the hell is going on? Yet? Well, we're never leaving this room. Joey, come in. Please report Sass. Joey, hello. It's Jude. Joey, are you okay? Joey, please over. Yes, I'm safe. I'm in the attic. Just barely made it. Phew. Over. Lots in. Actually, I dropped the key. Safer in attic than the rest of house. He can be retrieved later. Over. I think you're right. The way they smashed through the living room window on the front door. If I'd stayed in my room, I'd be a goner. Separated us with Vanguard. Destabilized power. Probe defenses. Finally attempted entry through multiple points of ingress. Basic siege tactics. Over. You know what? Wow, you were right! I'm impressed! Guess all those conspiracies you always talk about turn out to be, uh, not fake, maybe? Too soon to tell for sure, but absolutely certain, correct. <laughs> Too soon to tell for sure, but we're absolutely certain that we're correct. Um, and have always been. Over. Or always have been. Over. Anyways, thanks. So I'll just hold up in here for now, I guess. Are you safe in the treehouse? Should you try calling your friends or something? Didn't want to risk their involvement. Always gamble engaging soldiers of fortune. But maybe in time. Main secure in location, ignore object under curtain. Over. I'm not going to ignore it. Obviously, I'm not going to ignore it. Joy, please. Over. What? It's a big mysterious thing under a beguiling, <laughs> fluttery curtain. I have to at least peek at it. What is it anyway? Data insufficient to determine. Over. Well, I'll just let you know when I find out. Joey, don't tact Aries it ep over. You there, Joe oh or it uh, uh, bad idea over. <laughs> Dude, can you repeat that? That's a static. Joey, I can't who's you just, is d <laughs> go n it hit portal <laughs> for Did you say portal? Wait, how does he know it's a portal? Put this in the... Did that move? That moved. Put this in the attic yourself because it's... Weirded you out and your pa had a... Er, because it weirded you out that your pa had a lamp shaped like a woman's leg, little did you know, he soon graduated to shape lamp shaped like entire women. Rose in crisis, if only Captain Planet were here, then the monsters could eat him and you could escape while they were distracted. Well, it turns out you live in a house that has a hand and jar in it. You must now carry this knowledge with you forever. High five. You left them hanging long enough. In fact, as you stare at the gross, desiccated hand and jar, you begin to suspect that the time for you to break open this jar and slap it, or slap an anonymous dead hand against your own alive hand, is tragically past. Another bit of Jude's overzealous crowbarring, no doubt. Any chance he gets to go prying and Jimmy and the kid goes nuts out. Oh, is that a map? The handwriting is barely legible and there's no return address leaving you no more information than you had before you looked at it. 
No, it really isn't kind of mystery. The boring kind where you have to frequently refer to your rigorously maintained collection of shipping invoices in order to make any progress. You hate those. So you guys, first best shotgun, this one fell out of favor, and now primarily actions as a home to the thick layer of attic dust. Meanwhile, its favored brother is living out of shotgun's daydream in the hands of your pa. There's certainly no chance you're going to pick up this gun, and you certainly aren't going to lock and load anytime soon. It just isn't going to happen. Aww. What the heck? Disguising yourself and impairing your vision wouldn't really help matters much. You're pretty sure the monsters are going to eat anybody they meet. Ick, more of his guns. These are antiques and would probably fetch a tidy sum at auction. But you think the only real pert to their antiquity is probably means, or is it probably means it's been ages since they were used to murder anything furry and precious. Some very old pigeon cases, you suggest they th be thrown out. The old cages definitely fits with the aesthetic up here. Why does he love globes so much? Maybe they remind him of adventure. A little abstract geological features. Jagged borders of exotic no or nations. The tiny bumps representing mountains. Fortunately, whenever you look at globes in school or wherever, you, it just reminds you of, or they just remind you of him. I'll read the sentence someday. Alright, let's, let's do this. We're doing exactly what we were told not to. That clock is a reference. Can't avoid noticing the drape rustling around, although you really wish you could. Better see what's under there now, though, before it gets the drop on you. Yeah, it might be alive. We better, uh, better uncover it. We are making this happen. Look, you have no idea what this is. You don't know where it came from or how long it's been there. Did you know about this? Is that what he really sent you? To, or is that why he really sent you to the attic? No, that that doesn't make any sense. He did your pa know? It's kind of different from the stuff he usually dumps off here. Feels different in your mind, at least. You wait, what you you're having trouble thinking clearly. I'm keeping your train of thought. How, how long have you been standing here? I don't know how to operate this thing, except, of course, to put a key in and turn it. Seems like the obvious thing, doesn't it? The most obvious necessary thing you've ever known. We're always going to do, and have always known, and do it. Do it, do it now. 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 The key. Do it. Open the door. Yes, definitely. Yes. Jeez. Wow. Yes. You. Okay. Yeah, you want to do that. Just, yeah, the keyhole. Do it. Do it. You feel like you have to. We're doing this. What? Living key. Okay, we're dead. I want one. Oh, this is what Jude had drawings of, not the thing in the hallway. What could possibly go wrong in the next five seconds? They should have high-fived. It would have been glorious. When given the chance, always high-five something. But... 
What's up, robot? Seems like something pretty intense went down here just before you arrived. That's vibrating with fury. We're gonna look at this. Some kind of weird electric bug? It seems to be trying to communicate. Maybe you should pick it up for a closer look. We got the flashing board. Words blink on the screen in an unfamiliar alphabet. For some reason, you can understand it anyway. Hello, somewhere there. Is this the chat room? Moderator is present. I request some assistance, please. Tetrarch. There was a huge explosion, Excel. Oh, that's his little... Okay, that's cute. So, I have to clarify this real quick for you guys. Um, trolls have typing quirks. So, notice how this guy didn't capitalize anything. That's probably part of his quirk. Um, there's probably more to it than that. Also, saying explosion and the X being thing. That's probably a reference to horns or something in some way. Um, that tends to be a going thing because they sort of customize their little like emoticons and stuff like that to look like themselves. Which I think is super duper cute. Um, anyways, so this guy probably has a thing going with the letter X. Were you harmed? Thanks for asking, though I didn't see any explosion. Oh, that's the guy we swapped with. Well, maybe I did. Sora? The roof of your hive is totally jacked. You say so. Wait, you can see my roof? Who are you? What do you mean my hive? Oh, this is Joey typing. Okay. Oh. Oh no. I'm sorry, I forgot the code again. I really try, I swear. It makes more sense that there wasn't more to that typing quirk. Just because I was so worried thinking I wasn't thinking or thinking about blah, blah, blah. just because I was so worried about you, I wasn't thinking and it'll never happen again, I promise. I what's going on? So you notice he doesn't have apostrophes and things like that as well. That's probably part of his quirk. Nothing, all that matters is that you're okay. You're okay, right? Who are you? <laughs> I'm Zephyros. Oh no. That was a test or something, wasn't it? <laughs> or that was a test, wasn't it? Okay, I know I just said it would never happen again, and I mean that starting from now. No exceptions to the code. I'm absolutely not Zephyros. Right. Where am I? Okay, yeah, I know this one for sure. You're in your basement, right? I mean, you're not there. You're somewhere else. Oh, there's a winky face. I, um... Oops, I say the wrong thing? Where do you want me to tell you where you are? Sorry. I'm, um... Why are you apologizing? It never hurts to be sorry. I like this kid. So, um, Zephyros, I'm getting them in a basement somewhere you think we shouldn't say that? Yeah, that's exactly right. I got it right. Uh, did I? If you say so. I suppose you know what the deal with the huge machine with the snakes on it. It's sort of like the one in my attic. But the one in my attic wasn't so space age and it didn't have a weird force field bubble. Attic? Yeah, you know, down the hall, up the stairs. Ice room in the house. Oh, duh! More code! He's got it. Sorry. Yeah, the secret weapon. Sorry about that. Tetrarch. Damic. Secret weapon? Tetrarch Damic. Sorry, I know I keep messing up. I'm doing my best. What is Tetrarch Damic? Um, your name? Wait a minute. That's too many letters for a troll. They're supposed to have six letters. I I'm mad. I mean, not your name. My name isn't Tetra Damic. Of course not. Never know who might be reading. Oh jeez, what was your code name again? My name is Joey. Right, I knew that. Oh my gosh. It's all my fault. I'm sorry. I had no idea things would go so wrong. Wait, what? I was going to ask you first, but then I thought maybe it was a quiz, and if I had to stop to ask you, I would fail. So, I just put the battery in the weapon like you said. 
What? What are you talking about? Thought you left that weird paper out on the crate as instructions. Your paper. Not weird. Great. Plan is great, Joey. The Harris will never expect it. I mean, I'm still not sure what it is exactly. Or, yeah, but still. Just proud to be entrusted with such an important duty. Hey, let me get back to you. Do something with a tablet and this control panel, but you don't know how. Maybe talk to that guy again? Zephyros, that can't be his real name, right? That's just something about a weird paper on the floor. He was being pretty weird himself. You get the sense it might be kind of important. Maybe if you stretch all your problem-solving skills to their limit, you might be able to find the paper that is clearly laying on a chunk of crate right there in plain view. Pick up a hand-drawn, scribbled-on diagram of the portal showing how the pieces fit together. Hey, I found the paper you were talking about. So what do I do with it? Well, uh, okay, give me a minute. I know this. Hara, I'm really sorry. I think you'd be quizzing me right after what happened. I swear I'll prepare better next time. Look, the troll that he's expecting and Joey's brother are going to get along so well, I can't even handle it. It's okay. Wow, really? Yes, really. It's not a quiz. I have no idea what any of this means. Oh, jeez. Is it a test? No. Seriously, I have no idea what's going on here. I've never seen this thing before. What is it telling me? I'm doing my best, but I don't know what you want me to do. Please tell me what you want me to say. Um, this paper seems like a schematic for the portal I just came through. It's kind of familiar. Not just the portal, but the paper itself. I don't know how that would be possible, though. Anyway, is that right? This is a diagram for the snake machine? Well, if I remember right, that thing is a guide to the weapon. The weapon? You mean this snake portal? Oops, the code. Okay, yes, the portal. Can I unlock the snake machine with this? Is that what I should do? Unlock the snake machine? Oh, the serpent security program for your hive's power hexagrid. Yes, if that's what you want, Tetrarch. You can always do whatever you want. Uh, wow. Well, uh, that thing you said, will that help me get out of here? Exactly. Just put all X... Here's... Oh, just put all ten fingers on the back of your tablet until the control panel uplink executes. X? Ten? Oh no. I'm in trouble. I did exactly what I'm not supposed to. It was a test and I blew it, of course. You remember. <laughs> I definitely sh shouldn't have said any of that. <laughs> oh my gosh, no! My, <laughs> my sweet precious child! <laughs> so sorry, it's hard to keep up with these espionage rules sometimes. <laughs> Okay, um, I'll just check that out. I'm so sorry, Tetrarch. Oh, Zephyros. I'm just gonna leave you to whatever it is that you do. Alright, I'm gonna cut the episode off here and I'll see you guys next one. Bye!